Hello guys, welcome to my channel. The error code 0x80001FFF cannot connect to the PS4, PS5 is encountering when users attempt to connect their PS4 or PS5 through remote play on the Windows PC or the mobile device. The error code appears after the error connection attempt fails. So, what you need to do first is make sure you are using the latest version of the remote play. You can download the latest version by clicking the link in the description, then proceed with the installation PS Remote Play. Also make sure that your devices are always up to date with the latest version of the system. Now, if you are sure about the things I just said above, and still cannot connect to PS4 or PS5, then unregister the device. To do that, launching PS Remote Play then go to Settings. Click on Sign Out then restart your computer. Next, on PS4 go to Settings. Scroll down then select Remote Play Connection Settings. When inside, simply check the box associated with Enable Remote Play. If it is enable, then disable and re-enable. Once Remote Play is enabled, go back Settings. Select Account Management and make sure that this console is activated as your primary PS4. If it isn't, you should configure it by clicking the Activate as your primary PS4 option under the Account Management. Now, connect the controller to your PC using a USB cable or pair it using the DualShock 4 USB wireless adapter. Once prompted to do so, sign in with your PlayStation Network account. Select your controller and wait for the connection to be established and see if you're still encountering the same 0x080001FFF error code. If the error still occurs, please go to PS4. Then go to Settings. Scroll down then select Remote Play Connection Settings. Select Add Device. Now on the connected device, enter the code that appears on the PS4 system. Click on link and wait for the connection to be established and see if you're still encountering the same 0x080001FFF error code. Method 2. Temporarily uninstall third-party antivirus software. According to some affected users, this problem can very well be caused by some type of interference caused by an overprotective AV suite that ends up interrupting the connection with your PS4 due to a false positive. If this scenario is applicable and you're using a third-party security suite, you should be able to resolve this problem swiftly by uninstalling the third-party antivirus and prevent the interruption from happening. Method 3. Enabling UPnP. For computer, go to Settings. Select Network and Internet. Select Advanced Network Settings. Select Advanced Sharing Settings. Now check the Turn on Network Discovery option. UPnP has now been enabled for the Windows computer. Next, launch a browser on your computer. Type in your IP address in the address bar which in most cases is 192.168.1.1. This is the IP address which is associated with your router, you can also check the back side of the router to get the IP address. Press Enter to navigate to the ISP's login page. Enter the username and the password for your router. Now, you just need to find it in your settings for your router and enable it. That's it guys, hope this helped you. If there are any other possible methods please leave a comment below the video. Thanks.